Right. Good evening, everybody. My name is JP Rodemeyer, the founder and creator of Transunder, the Next Generation Community Program. I am going to be doing the presentation tonight, not Dylan Harwood. Um, and this presentation will be updated onto the, uh, um, the official Zoom, uh, sorry, the official YouTube channel. <laughs> right. Okay. So um, I am going to give a little bit of an update if we have time, but please note this, uh, this presentation will only be 30 minutes, okay? We will do a longer presentation, the normal one, on Friday, 7 p.m. South Africa time. Right, so first of all, who am I? My name is JP Radame. I come from South Africa. I have been in website development, game development, PC support, um, anything to do with IT basically for the last 23 years. I have developed and helped develop various systems for all kinds of people all over the world. A lot of members around the world know about my platforms that I have developed um, or helped develop. But unfortunately, a lot of these uh, uh, platforms did not make the cut, right? They um, either collapsed due to um, uh, the wrong strategy of the founders. So I was only founders of one or two of the platforms. I will announce which platforms I was founders of. Um, that is basically Game to Give, um, a BTC Returns, Planet Matrix. Okay, Planet Matrix slows down merely because people just lost interest. All right, no other reason. Um, and then uh, Game for Bitcoin and of course, Tron Thunder. I was not a founder or creator of another platform that is out there um, company, yes, we have developed various systems for other companies, um, but I take no responsibility for those platforms. Once the system was developed, it was released to the uh, to the, the founders of those systems, and um, we would just support the system if there is any bugs inside of the systems. Right. So my company, South Coast Web, started in 1998. Um, it's actually my father's company. Um, Johan Rodemeyer, and um, we started it in South Africa here in South Coast, Margate. Okay, so we also own Margate.co.za. And um, when we started the company, there literally was not internet on the coast. There was no internet. We installed dial up internet uh, um, uh, 56K modems into numerous of our clients that we accumulated during the years into their PCs. And then we went over to ADSL and ISDN and all those things. Um, and now we're currently sitting on fiber in South Africa. So it's really, really exciting how it has progressed during the years. Okay. So I have seen the internet from the beginning stages when we use Telnet to access it to where now everybody's using Chrome browser. Netscape has disappeared. It doesn't exist anymore. Okay, so with all of my vast experience, I decided that I am going to build my own platform. The reason being is I am honestly, I'm just, I am so tired of getting to join the next new thing that's out there. And I don't know who the founders is. I don't know if I can trust the founders and it collapses. It's not just me that gets uh, um, hurt by this. It's also my members that I introduced to these platforms. Right. I haven't really marketed in, in the last year due to this happening to, to, to my members. Okay, So I rather decided I'm building my own thing. And as everybody know who is a member of Transunder, I have hit gold. Right, We are currently at over 70,000 members. We're signing 1,000 members plus every single day, minimum 1,000 people every single day. All right, And the business is just booming okay um currently there is some uh of my associates if i can put them like that that is in dubai we are looking at what's going on with the metaverse all right um i have decided to not do any marketing and things while we are in dubai there's a very specific reason for this okay we are still in the decision of whether we're going to be registering tron thunder in south africa and whether we're going to be registering it in dubai all right dubai has brought up a lot of laws and currently is blocking south africa completely okay so it's important that we do the right decisions and also see where we're going to be pushing our cryptocurrencies in the future 
Now, first of all, what Transunder is not is a smart contract. I want everybody to understand this very clearly. It is not a smart contract. I'm not going to go into full detail why it's not a smart contract. I'm just going to put it like this. It's not a smart contract because, number one, if it was a smart contract, you would be paying 47 Tron minimum in transaction fees every single time you make a withdrawal, right? Every single time you make a withdrawal, you would have to pay 47 Tron. Because remember, when a smart contract is initiated, it is a set of instructions that has been saved on the blockchain, all right? The other reason why we are not on a smart contract is because it can never be changed. Yes, that's a good thing in certain aspects, but it doesn't, uh, it stops people from, uh, well, it stops me from upgrading the software, okay? So I can't produce better quality products for our members. And this is what we want to introduce. We want to create a platform that is a community-based system where the community members become members by paying a membership fee, all right? And then they're introduced to cryptocurrencies. So you can basically make money and also teach people how to make money by teaching them about cryptocurrency. That's, that's basically what Tron Thunder is in a nutshell, okay? Now, Tron Thunder is still verified on the blockchain okay this means that we are using a tron api okay that's specially written for tron thunder that verifies every single transaction that happens when you make a withdrawal or make a payment right so this doesn't mean that everything is just run in the in the coding and it's not on the blockchain it's still on the uh, um, on the blockchain now when you join and you register and you pay Please, when you get to the payment screen, it says there, don't close the screen. It takes five minutes, okay, it's for you to make the payment. It verifies the payment. It takes two minutes roughly to verify the first transaction, okay? That is the API wallet address that it verifies. Once it's verified this, then it will transfer it to the company wallet that is open public on, on, um, on the blockchain once again, okay? Once uh, um, the second transaction has been verified, which is another two minutes, so in total it takes about five minutes, your account will be activated. Do not refresh your page. Do not close your page, your payment page, with the little circle that turns, until five minutes is finished. Once five minutes is finished, please, you can refresh your page, okay? And then your account should be activated. Now, the advantages of Tron Thunder, it's safe and secure, all right? Instant withdrawals. If you have qualified to earn, uh, um, to make a withdrawal on Tron Thunder and you press the withdrawal button, you submit the amount that you are withdrawing, you will instantly get that withdrawal. Yes, it will still take between two and five minutes to verify the transaction on the blockchain, okay? But when you press the button, it will automatically withdraw. So we're not going to stop anybody to make withdrawals. There is no person that's going to have to press a button on my admin to um, authorize the withdrawals as well. Okay. There is no such thing. Everything is done automatically through the algorithm in the, in the website. Okay. So you get free tokens. So our first token was the TTT token. This is officially completed. All right. So our um, distribution of the 70 million tokens okay, has been distributed between the entire community. So all the new members, you are getting a new token. This token is called NetWith, and I will be giving more information on Friday, right? The website is 100% user-friendly. It's easy to start and 100% transparent. Like I said, every single transaction you can verify on the blockchain. Okay, the power and growth of cryptocurrency. So originally, they started with Bitcoin. Bitcoin in 2009 was worth a couple of cents, right? 0 0.001 uh, cent to my knowledge, as far as I can remember here. Um, and today, it's worth over $40,000, right? I mean, imagine that massive growth, okay? But there is a flaw inside of Bitcoin. And the flaw is that number one, the transaction fees is extremely expensive. It takes very, very long, okay? Not a lot of transactions can be verified at the same time. It uses what is called proof of work, okay? So these are miners that mine uh, um, the Bitcoin, verifying the transactions on the blockchain by um, uh, 
solving a very complicated algorithm, mathematical algorithm. Okay. So um, unfortunately, Bitcoin is a good store of value. It is called the digital gold as well. Okay. But um, for payment methods and uh, for business, it's not that it's not that wise to do. So if you want to store your money, yes, Bitcoin is amazing. Okay. So in 2015, Vitalik Buterin started Ethereum, right? And Vitalik was part of the original Bitcoin consortium. Okay, he also wrote um, a magazine, which was the Bitcoin magazine, if I'm not mistaken, um, where he introduced members and people to cryptocurrencies. Okay, uh, but he started Ethereum and he started what was called smart contracts. Okay, so he saw that there is a lack inside of Bitcoin when it comes to businesses where you can integrate the cryptocurrency into businesses, into transactions of the business and so forth. Okay, but unfortunately, Vitalik made one mistake. He still made a proof of work, which means they stole miners, which means that in the beginning, the transactions was very affordable, but it ended up becoming very expensive. Okay, so then my favorite came in, Tron. Okay, so Justin Sun who was the CEO of Tron. He has recently stepped down. And this is a good thing. Don't stress about it, please. I'm not going to go into detail about this tonight, but it is a good thing because it's made Tron decentralized. All right. And it's not 100% decentralized yet. Once uh, the Tron consortium closes or uh, um, dissolves in July, then it will become completely decentralized. Okay. But he introduced something called proof of stake. Okay, this means that there is only 20 super representatives that verify the transactions on the blockchain. So number one, the transactions is extremely affordable. It's also a smart contract. So you still got the business concept of Ethereum, but it's super fast comparing to Ethereum and Bitcoin. Okay, now introducing our first coin, which was who is the Tron Thunder token, apologies, all right, and yes, now I'm announcing it officially. TTT is our first multi-chain token developed by Tron Thunder. It completed its 70 million community allocation phase in 2021. Now, until TTT goes over to public sale, the value of TTT will grow parallel with the value of Tron. So for every TRX you're, is one, is, is valued at one TTT. All right, there's a total supply of 210 million. And yes, that's 10% of what Bitcoin is. Um, there's, there was a private supply. This is gone. Okay, that's 70 million that has been uh, distributed. And then there will be a public supply and a company supply. All right, we will be announcing what is going to happen with the public supply and the company supply on the 10th. That's on Friday. So the token distribution. Um, like I said, 33.33%, 70 million is the trans community supply. Um, 70 million is in public supply. Marketing and general supply is 35 million and operational overhead supply is 35 million. So that's basically the company supply. Now, the roadmap for the trans token. So TTT was created in July, 2021. Now, please note that TTT is still not a cryptocurrency. Okay, we are busy developing this, okay? And like I said, it's going to be a multi-chain cryptocurrency. Now, we'll also announce more what that is on Friday. We're not going to go in full detail. The initial TTT distribution and marketing will start in January this year. Okay, so this month. The public sale will start in July, right? That's when the public sale will start. Um, in October, TTT will be listed on 10, the top 10 exchanges and community should have reached at least 1 million members. Now we all know why we want to get 1 million members because then when we introduce a new business, new cryptocurrency, um, we can bring in um, other companies to advertise to our members. We've got a big community and we become an unstoppable crypto community. Okay, and March 2023, TTT will be listed on 20 exchanges and TTT reaches 1.5 million blockchain wallets. In September 2023, um, we'll reach 2 million blockchain wallets, 1 billion USD market cap, 0.5 million social media followers in the community. Right? So we are busy building the community and we have announced this. The quicker we reach 30,000 members, right? Members, not accounts, members inside of our Telegram channel, the quicker we're going to be starting the public 
sale. Okay. In December 2023, integration into leading blockchain projects. This is future, all right? So we're not going to announce what exactly that is going to be um, until we get closer to that date, okay? And then in March 2024, we want to have our own wallet created. Now, this is our roadmap, okay? These dates might become closer or a bit later. It depends on what's going to be happening in the next two years. Everybody knows, what is my goal? In 10 years from now, I want to be sitting on 1 billion members, okay? 1 billion members will be the biggest crypto community in the world. So um, in February, 2022, we want to have a total active, particip active participants of 100,000. We're currently sitting at 70,000. So I'm very, very confident that we're gonna be reaching this goal. In June 2022, we'll be sitting at 500,000 uh, um, active participants. In September 2022, we'll be sitting at 1 million active participants. Now, traditional MLM company. This is one thing that Tron Thunder is absolutely not, all right? Um, we are not a hybrid. We are not um, a uh, force matrix. Uh, we're not a binary structure, right? We have got a combination, all right? So I guess, yeah, in a sense, we are a bit of a hybrid, but there is no pyramid shapes in our business, okay? So do not even think of that. Um, first of all, we got the Tron Thunder community side, okay? So this is a single line matrix, right? Meaning that the next person that joins the business, regardless where they are, okay, in the world, and whether it's your downline or somebody else's downline, the next person that joins falls under the next per uh, the previous person. Right. So this is the beautiful thing about this project. In the beginning, it took roughly about three days. I'm talking about in August, three days for you to get 20 people underneath you. Right. Now, as you are joining, you already have got 100 Tron you can withdraw. You, you, you're sitting within two minutes. You've got 20 people that's already underneath you. Right. And you earn from that community line. OK, you earn one percent depending on your um, qualification that you that you have for, for your membership package, okay? You earn 1% on every single level for 20 levels up and 20 levels down, okay? So that gives you a total of 40% that you could potentially earn. Right, okay, so the packages. We have got five exciting packages. Silver package is 400 trons and you'll get 400 tokens okay now this used to be ttt now it is net worth all right why did i write tokens because once net worth is finished then there will be a new token very simple okay this activates 12 levels up and 12 levels down all right and this is in your community rewards your gold is 600 trx you get 600 tokens activate you 14 levels up and 14 t levels down sapphire is 800 trx you get 800 tokens and 16 levels up and 16 levels down um, qualification community rewards. Emeralds is a thousand Tron. You get a thousand tokens, 18 levels up and 18 levels down. And Ruby is a thousand two hundred TRX. You get a thousand two hundred tokens and it's activated 20 levels up and 20 levels down. Friday is the last day. Okay. The 10th is when we are closing the Ruby Club. I will announce exactly what this is. Um, in the next couple of slides, but everybody be, wake up, push your business now so you can become a Ruby member. You do not want to mess this out. Okay. Right. So we've got the 40% figured out. Now what's, what happens with the 60%? Because what's the difference with Tron Thunder is that we are a hundred percent distributed company. Okay. So, which means there's no admin fee. There is absolutely no admin fee. Yes, the company does make money. The company makes money by all of the unqualified commissions, right? So, which means if you come in in a silver package, you've got eight levels up and down that you do not qualify to earn commissions on. Those commissions go up to the company, to the right. Now, the 60% is your uni-level structure. This means there is no spillover. I have got a numerous request for a special position inside the business. I personally hate that, but... It is a, a norm in, in typical systems, right? It doesn't help. I can give you any position. It does not help, okay? If you do not build your downline, right, 
that will not help you to get a special position. There is no special positions. You cannot get any spillover, right? So you will not earn from your upline inside of Tron Thunder. I want to make this very clear. You do not earn from your upline in Tron Thunder. You earn from your downline and from the community. Okay, so in the uh, um, unit level structure, your directs is your first level. Their directs is your second level, their directs your third, and so forth all the way to seven levels, okay? So your first level, you get 20%, then you get 5% up until your fifth level, and 10% on your sixth, and 10% on your seventh level, all right? That gives you a total of 60% commissions that you're going to be earning. Give you a simple little example of why you want to achieve this, all right? You need five directs to qualify for seven levels. When I had COVID, this was literally about two weeks after I launched Tron Thunder in India. Okay. I, I got COVID. I nearly passed away. It was really, really scary. But what was even more scary is when I eventually got better because now I didn't have all these people taking care of me and I had to take care of myself. I had to take care of my family. And I opened up my Tron Thunder account and I was sitting there, well, oh, okay, I got $2,000 there. That was amazing. I mean, I sat at $2,000. I could pay my accounts. Um, I wasn't in trouble anymore. And I, I was so excited to just start uh, um, pushing the business worldwide. Okay. The scary thing is I lost $3,000. Okay. The reason why I lost $3,000 is because I did one simple mistake. I did not get my first five people. I only got three. So I didn't qualify for my sixth and my seventh levels. And on my seventh level, I lost out to 30,000 Tron. Right, so the Thunder Gift Rewards. The Thunder Gift Rewards is also only up until the 10th of January. So it's only a couple of days left, right? So for the first 20 people that you introduce to the business, you will get X amount of TRX and X amount of tokens. This will end, okay? But something better will come into its place, right? Something that is more profitable and more um, exciting for our strong networkers. And this is called the Thunder VIP Rewards, okay? So the same 10% that would have gone to the Thunder Gift Rewards, that is being divided 5% of 5%, all right? And 5% will go to the VIP four members and 5% will go to the VIP five to seven members, right? So this means every 24 hours, 10% of the total amount of TRX revenue generated by all the new members, by all the new members is split and 5% will be distributed to the VIP four achievers and 5% will be distributed between VIP five to seven achievers, okay? So an example of this, if the total generated um, TRX in 24-hour period is 10 million Tron, okay? 10% of that would be a million Tron. Now, currently, we're sitting at 47 VIP4 members. If you divide that, that means that every single one of those VIP4 members would be getting 10,600 Tron. That's currently, okay? Um, the VIP5 to 7, there's only 23, all right? They would be receiving 21,000 700 tron plus or minus but more okay right so this is a much bigger um advantage all right it's a much bigger goal to achieve and is it difficult to achieve vip four and five six seven status it's not easy but it is very achievable we have got some strong leaders that have become vip four members in 35 days right so the harder you work in this business, the more you're going to be achieving. Now, the Ruby Royalty Club, okay? So I just want to take this confusion away. The Ruby package, the Ruby membership will always be there, okay? It will always be there. But if you become a Ruby member by the 10th, all right? The 10th of uh, uh, January, it ends, the club, okay? then you will be part of this Ruby Club. The Ruby Club, 10% of the total TRX revenue generated 
by all the new members is once again divided between every Ruby Club member. So where does this extra revenue come from? Where Because we're 100% distributable company. It doesn't come from you. It comes from the money that Transunder makes. Okay. So from all of the unqualified positions. So that capital gets divided um, into expenses for the company and the expenses include the Ruby Royalty Club and will also include the um, Thunder Gift Rewards until um, the 10th, okay? And then it will go over to the VIP um, Achievers Rewards. All right, so VIP rankings. For VIP one and two, you do not need any directs. You can achieve this, okay? Um, by you earning from the community, okay? So once you hit two and a half thousand Tron in total to reward, this is uh, Ruby Club rewards, um, uh, community rewards, okay, in this case, okay? And if you have directs, then it will be your uh, direct downline rewards as well. This combined is your total TRX reward, okay? So once you hit two and a half thousand TRX, you will get 125 tokens. That's 5% of 2,500 TRX, okay? Now, your withdrawal stays at 50% up until VIP3. To achieve VIP3, you need to have 10 directs, and you have to have 25,000 TRX in total TRX rewards. You will get 1,250 tokens, and your withdrawal will change to 60%, okay? So what do I mean by this? Okay, so when you make a withdrawal, 50% goes to your actual wallet, to your Tron wallet. The other 50% goes back, all right? This is your repurchase. And for this repurchase, you will get X amount of tokens. So if you're going to, uh, your repurchase is 5,000 for an example, you will get 5,000 um, tokens, all right? Which in currently is net worth tokens. But once you hit VIP3, then your withdrawal to your wallet is 60%. And 40% is your repurchase. When you hit VIP4, this is 20 directs that you require, 100,000 Tron, your withdrawal changes to 70%. Okay. All right. And then you'll get five, once again, 5% 5 of that. So 5,000 tokens. And VIP5, 6, and 7, that is all uh, you still only require your 20 directs. You're not going into a higher withdrawal limit because otherwise the system would become absolutely pointless. All right. So I kind of already explained this. The magic of the auto repurchase is when you make a withdrawal, 50%, 60%, and 70%, depending on where you are in the VIP ranking, will go to your wallet. The balance is your repurchase. You'll get um, a, a token rewards for this, okay? That is That goes into your account. And also, all right, this money doesn't come to the company. I want to make this very clear. The money does not go into the company. So when you withdraw 1,000 Tron, 500 Tron goes to your wallet, 500 Tron goes back into the community and gets split 60, 40, right? Now, there's no guarantees of earnings without effort. And just like any legitimate business, it requires effort to earn. There's a very fair opportunity for receiving community rewards. But the more people you refer and the more team members you help, the more you will earn, all right? Now, I've got a simple strategy. I've even created a video of this. I call it the five-team strategy, all right? So the first thing you do when you join is you get five people. You get these five people in five days. You teach your five people that you got to do the same thing, and they teach their people to do the same thing. In 25 days, you will be setting up a downline of over 3,000 members. That's more than what I currently have. And currently... My account is generating anything between $250 to $1,000 per day, right? So remember, there's a withdrawal. So when I withdraw, 70 and 30%. Okay, so on the previous slide, just want to say one thing. My personal goal is to achieve 90,000 members in my downline, okay? By doing this, and I want to do this in eight months, okay, so by August, June, July, August, yes. <laughs> By August, I want to reach 90,000 members in my total downline. And this will give me an average um, TRX of 100,000 per day. Okay. So that is currently 
about $9,500 per day. Okay, and remember this is in Tron, right? So whatever you have in Tron is cryptocurrency. When you convert your Tron over to a fiat-based currency, all right, then you will be liable for taxes. Please note this, okay? Um, every single member is responsible for paying their own taxes that they earn from Tron, uh, Tron Thunder, sorry. Okay. Right. Thank you, everybody. Um, let's see. What's the time? <laughs> one minute. Okay. Right. So I have got one announcement. Okay. Um, we are going to be, it depends where we are going to be registering the company, right? But I want to prepare everybody for this. We are going to be doing a rebranding of Tron Thunder, okay? We have been advised that to have a company name and a token of the same name is not a good thing for compliance. And as I've said many, many times is I want uh, Tron Thunder to be 100% compliant. Okay, so um, there will be a rebranding, which means a new domain name, uh, new designs, everything. Now, what I would advise every single member, your marketing material, please, on your link that you have posted there, please also go say that you can register with your user ID and change the link to tronthunder.io um, because... When the members go to tronthunder.io and they go register, they've got your user ID. Nobody can register inside of Tron Thunder without a user ID. It's not possible, okay? But once they get into the registration page, they can go and type in the user ID and they will register underneath you, underneath your ID that you have provided, okay? So I am preparing everybody. We are going to be doing a rebranding. This means a new domain. This means your referral links will not work. But your user ID, which is the back of your referral link, that will always be the same. Okay. So this is a personal note just to everybody. Please, please um, just be aware that we are going to be doing a rebrand. All right. Awesome. Okay. Like I said, I have got a, another Zoom meeting, the German Zoom meeting that I have to attend. And um, I will be back on Friday. Uh, Dylan will be doing the presentation. I will be in the presentation. I will be doing some Q and A, and of course, I will give the exciting updates that everybody is waiting for. Okay, that's it from me, JP Rodemay, South Africa. Um, God bless everybody. Good night. <laughs>